they don't make teachers like this no more. They don't make teachers like this no more. You see how he's explaining the pump fake? Like he's getting in perfect form. He's getting nice with it. He's showing how to hold that ball. He's getting in form. He's showing how to shake, how to do everything you need to do. And then he takes off and lifts off into the air like that. Listen, they don't make teachers like this no more, man. I can I can clearly see that my brother never made it to the NBA, but I can tell. I can look and tell the way he was holding that ball, the way he's doing the poses, the way he's doing the moves. He clearly has game. He has game. And he almost probably made it, but he probably got this story. He ended up hurting his knee. He was probably on his way to the league, but he ended up hurting his knee or pulling his back or something. And he ended up being a substitute teacher. And there's nothing wrong with that because he can still train people and express his love and his passion for basketball. But I want to take this time out to give his brother a round of applause because this is what we need. We need teachers, more teachers with enthusiasm. You see the, the passion in which this man is showing what he will do on the basketball court. Now, I'm guessing this might correlate to a physics class or something like that, but he's showing certain moves, how to square yourself off, how to hold that ball down low so nobody can get it, and how to protect yourself and also how to take that beautiful step and literally glide into the air. See, these kids have learned a lot today. They've learned a lot. They've learned, like, if you don't make it to the league or you don't make it in sports, what you can do. You could always show people what it would have looked like if you would have made it to the league and how you would have held the ball or how you would have even threw the ball. This is what it is, man. Yo, tell this brother to call me, man. Round of applause.